Here's a quick sh video of uh, some testing I'm doing on my APM. Here's the APM mounted in the uh, chassis of the of the AV dome from RC Timers. The uh, board on the bottom is the APM 2.5.2 board and the board on the top is the combination um, magnetic compass and GPS. And back here you can see the receiver. It's an orange R800X. And I'm using the DX6i as the uh, the, uh, the transmitter. And here's a shot of the, I don't know how well you can see this, here's a shot of Mission Planner. And let me switch it over so you can see the bigger numbers. Since it's sitting in here and it's not all clamped down the way it's supposed to be and I don't have the barometer covered properly, there's a little twitchiness to the numbers. It's uh, dancing around just a little bit even though it's sitting still. And you can see that the uh, image is showing uh, approximately where it's sitting in my house. And then we'll go back here and we'll see if I can remember how to throw all these switches. So first it's armed and you can see it's in stabilized mode but uh, we don't know that for sure so let's first arm it. Arm. And now we're armed in stabilize mode. And you can see on the on the uh, GPS unit on top, the two, the red and the blue lights, instead of flashing now, are solid, which says that it's armed. And the green light flashing, I guess, says that I've got a GPS fix. And if you look on here, you'll see that I do have a GPS fix, 3D. And if we go to the status, You'll be able to see here, if it focuses, that I've got uh, eight satellites and a HDOP of about 2.02, which isn't great, but considering I'm in the house, it's not too bad. So, we're going to give it a little throttle so it doesn't drop out of, out of being armed. And then we're going to change some of the modes, and you'll see what happens here. See the bottom right, it says stabilize. Mode changed to loiter. Now I just changed to loiter. Of course, it's sitting still, so it's not really going to do anything. And we'll change another switch here. Mode changed to alt hold. That's the uh, altitude hold. Mode changed to loiter. Back to loiter. Mode changed to RDL. And we should have one more here. Mode changed to alt hold. Mode changed to loiter. Mode changed to RDL. Okay, one of these gives me auto. I'm not sure which Mode one. Mode changed to alt hold. Mode changed to loiter. Hmm. Some reason I'm not getting that the way I want to. And then this should put us back and stabilize. Mode changed to stay alive. And if I go to alt hold, if I can. Mode changed to RDL. Mode changed to alt hold. Okay, we're in altitude hold. Now I should be able to go into auto tune. Auto tune started. Okay, so that would be auto tuning. And we can shut that off and it stays on for a while. Not too exciting, but uh, it is working. And that in itself is exciting. So, okay, so I'll hold this off now and we can reduce the throttle and disarm. Disarm. And now you can see the lights are flashing again because we're not armed. It's out of focus here. So that's a little uh, quick
quickie view of what it, what the uh, progress I'm making right now. <laughs>